What's good everyone? What is good? Welcome back to the channel with y'all truly, of course, Machiavelli. Hope y'all having a great day today, guys. You know, you apologize, put my foot down. I apologize, guys, for all the pre-recorded episodes. I just love playing my Sims game so much. Like, you would think that maybe I could just play my current household, but no. Like, I love playing with this family more than i like playing with my current households so i always pre-record because i'm like i'm bored let me play the life of pearsons i'm bored let me just play with my city living i'm bored let me go play my legacy challenge like i love them so much that i just always want to play with them so there's always a pre-recorded video but i promise guys last pre-recorded video for this lp i promise that's it no more so anyways let's get straight into it so in the last part you saw that Crystal and Miss um, Crystal and Mr. Um, Sato got back together. It's not perfect, guys. I know it looked perfect. The relationship was great, but it's still not. There's still some ifs and buts, and they're taking it slow. Nothing is serious. Um, they still have, like, I was like, they still have a woohooed, but they kind of did at the thing. But, like, they're still taking it slow to understand. Like, they're taking it day by day. They don't want to rush it, but at the moment. So, anyways, that happened. And also, as you guys saw on the trailer, you know, I sneaked in a little trailer in there, hopefully, like, before I'm recording this. So, I made the trailer. I don't know if I added it yet, but I made it. You guys see that we got two new people to the household. You know that Lexi is back, guys. Lexi is finally back in the game. You can finally go out with us and all that. But, as you guys saw, she didn't come alone she came with a little one and his name is kai kai lee the my mom keon his name is keon k apostrophe e o n keon um and it's marcelo's child and you're like wait that makes no sense she was gone for all this time wait didn't they have sex? guys y'all remember the at her goodbye party they went to the, the abandoned house or the museum and they slept in the bed together right well, a lot happened there, but then this whole there's there's another story about Lexi that, um, like there's a lot guys, there's a lot about what happened with Lexi that I need to tell you guys about. But I don't know if I'm gonna tell you guys in this part or the next part. But for right now, maybe I'll tell you guys when Lexi decides to tell Marcelo why she did not call him when she found out she was pregnant. There's a lot that happened. Um, but we'll get into Lexi's story in the next part. Right now, everyone's just like, you see Crystal, big smile on her face because it was like, just right to the side with her, we have Litter Keon just playing with his food. Like, he was crying in the morning. She got up early, so she decided to take care of him and let him sleep in. Marcelo's still going crazy about having a, a child, him being a father. He's like, what? Because she literally just dropped in like, yo, this is your child. <laughs> Surprise. It was scary. Like, Lexi was hella nervous about this too, but I know you're wondering, like, how are the sleep situations going? Well, Sato and Crystal are sleeping in one bed, and then um, Crystal decided to give Lexi her bed. And of course, if um, Lexi came in here, she said she needed help with everything, and she needed a place to go. Of course, they're not going to turn her away, right? Because they're friends. Because one, they're good friends. Like, Crystal loves Lexi. And second, because that's that's um that's this, this is like this is her niece this is her niece that's her son she's not turning them away definitely so they just did the bed situation um i know you guys are wondering what if it's not his kid it's his kid guys look at him that's marcel that's marcelo's child i can't believe he's a father but anyways um it's four in the morning he got up late um he, well he got up late well early you could say and he was hungry so um crystal's taking care of him she's having some pancakes sato's up and i know you guys are wondering is she pregnant i checked already she is not i couldn't help it i was like let me just take a little sneak peek of um, she's not pregnant guys so don't worry um there's <laughs> some laying people down i'm sorry but she isn't uh, so he's done She's just enjoying his pancakes, and Sato really excites him. Oh, also, when Sato got up, he was thinking about this. He wants to get engaged to Crystal. I didn't do that. I can't do whims. That's what he wanted to do, not me. So I don't know when he's going to pop the question. It's not going to be anytime soon, of course, but at least we know that he really wants to do it. So we'll see what happens in the near future. I'm very, very excited for these two. I know some people might be like pissed that they're back together because we gave Sato so much chances. But the thing is, what happened is that, you know what? <laughs> Like I said before, they've been through so much, and I feel like Sato that night with um, them, I think maybe he was just playing it off because um, he thought, because he's like, like I said before, he, she didn't want no one to know about the relationship. She wanted this to be between them so they can work it out together. So when um, Roxanne or when other girls were flirting with him, he was just doing the right thing back, flirting with them because 
he was trying to act like he was single. Like, it's thought so. Of course, he's gonna, like, if he's single, he should be, he'd be able to do that. So maybe that's why she wasn't, like, showing off she was mad because they're not officially a back together. So she didn't want to, like, come off as jealous, but she was kind of mad at him. But once they sat down and they talked it over, she understands, right? She understands. You see, he's just, like, expressing his fondness to her. They love each other so much. And he does want to get back to, like, he does love her and she does love him. And this is just a perfect relationship. Um, but our dude over here is just clapping his hands. Um, we're gonna get him out the seat. <laughs> These two are just talking, aren't they? What's this? She wants to kiss off. We can definitely do that. But can you, um, Oh, these two are having a chat. Uh, what's this? More friendly um, play with. She's gonna play with him. And Sato, what's this? Is he at work today by any chance? Yeah, she hasn't worked in five hours. That's been completed. Oh, shit. <laughs> she needs that much followers. Darn it. Darn it. Darn it. Stop dancing. Are you gonna let Okay, she's gonna grab some thing. Are you gonna. Oh, he's gonna grab some pancakes. Um. What's this? Yeah, so you're gonna go play. So you can go play? What's this? Yeah, play. Are you like not gonna go and play? Is it you then? Yeah, go play. Oh, maybe because she's in the high chair. Maybe you have to let him out first. Um, pick up. Yo, Crystal, why are you, okay, let's say, why are you not doing nothing? Okay, pick him up and put him down. Look at the look she's giving, like, who are you? Um, well, she's gonna go upstairs. She needs to definitely um share a joke with people and then she is going to not post a rant not doing that again uh we are going to update status and then uh right i think that's it also guys um lacy did come in with a job she is um a stock clerk she's in the fashion designing career very excited for that she just started her job too like she like I want to tell us her story, but I want to do the next part when she's going to have a sit down with um, Marcelo. Because right now, they're like, they hug each other. Like, it's awkward between the two. She's like, oh, wait, why aren't they laughing? Okay, wait, they're, they are, but they're laughing at me instead. Oh, sorry, girl. Excuse me. But yeah, these two definitely need to talk. <laughs> um, what's this? Uh, so she gained followers. That's great. Lexi. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> so she wants to um be friends with her mom for sure she needs to talk to her mom now we are gonna uh we're gonna send him alone today i want to spend time with um the two munchkins like all three of them are gonna be home today um lacy and marcello all of them are gonna be up so it's gonna be hella awkward <laughs> really 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 awkward so what's this she's having some faux uh, Mama over here. What's this? She's checking on her son, making sure he's okay. He needs some amusement. So our girl, what's this? She's going to more friendly praise, and then we're gonna more friendly. We're going to play. Mom's gonna grab things to eat, which is fine. Oh geez. <laughs> okay, she's feeling hella sick. So we're gonna have her take. Um, Colin's sick for the day. What's this? Before we start playing with them, Colin, Colin's sick. And then... Hmm, let's tell him a joke. Let's be funny with him. Tell him a funny story. Tell him a funny story. Oh no. He's really not in the good mood. Uh, and then we'll play with him. So we're gonna do that. What's this? Roxanne is having a bit of trouble. I'm sorry. You're eating food in the morning. I'll do the same thing to be completely honest. Fall. Fall. In the morning. I'll do the same thing. Uh, our boy, oh, he's at work. Okay. Why doesn't he work hard? He needs to actually treat to patients. So we're definitely gonna have to, I'm gonna do that off screen. Definitely. We only have two more days to challenge them. We need to find, like, a, uh, what's called again? We need to find, um, what's this? Don't clean up. You don't have to clean up. We'll clean up for you. But you need to go in here and take a shower. And then, oh, she's so close to actually being done this. And then go upstairs. What she needs to do? Does she have like a muse? Okay, her muse. Oh god, she's not getting a promotion today. She's not getting a promotion today. Definitely. Uh, why don't we get your amusement up? Play some video games. No, don't enter a tournament. Play some video games. You have to do one anyways. Also, I gave her a little makeover, by the way. You know, her hair did grow out, so I grew out her hair. She didn't decide to dye it anymore, but she's wearing a crop that like. Roxanne's a very conservative type of girl, but you know what? What's this? Roxanne is taking the first step. Oh, on our cut. Never mind. Um, she's definitely um, a, a very 
Um, she likes to wear like clothes that covers her whole body. She doesn't like to stand out a lot. But you know what she said? You know what? Roxanne, let's break out of your shell and let's do it. So she's now wearing a crop top for once. And um, I think she has before, but not that much. But she's wearing a crop top now. And she's really breaking out of her shell. And I really want her to go meet that dude I made. But that's going to have to wait. Um, our boy's up. Who's this? Did you call in sick for work? Okay, she's on sick leave. What's this? Oh, she's taking a nap? Okay, she needs to go. Yeah, take, go, to, go take a nap. She's very tired. Go take a nap. And then my boy, um, where's he at? Why don't you go play with your son? Why don't you? Um, more friendly. Go play. I think that's going to be sweet. Yeah, have some father-son time. She's like, I don't want to play with you. Like, I don't want to play with you. It's like, oh, jeez. Kion got an attitude. <laughs> he wants nothing to do with his dad. Um, so they're going to oh, look at that. She was smiling. Uh, she's happy. I'm, I'm pretty sure she's very happy that that happened. What's this? She's going to play some basketball. <coughs> well, I, need, I, need, I need a photo of this. Oh, no. He's not enjoying this at all. Poor guy. Dad's trying, to, he's trying to play with him, but he's not enjoying this one bit. Actually, now he is. Like, guys, tell me right now. He is definitely Marcelo's kid. Um, I checked the family tree. Don't worry. I can show you guys again if you guys want me to, but he is definitely his dad's son. Okay. That's so cute. I love them. I really do. So she's out. What's this? She's not. She's gonna watch TV at least. So they're having fun. And then what's this? He is don't want to being defiant, and he needs some music. Is he getting some fun at least? He's getting no fun. Okay, he is getting fun. That's good. He's getting his fun up. <laughs> That's what I wanted. How is he not enjoying this? And then he's gonna go ahead and definitely hey he liked it okay that's good um why don't you go and potty train him for me potty train him because he needs oh geez he just pooped in his diaper <laughs> and then when you're done um change his diaper so she's just taking a little break you know she's actually was gonna do it but it's okay he's gonna do it um she's gonna clean up the house like I said before, she's like kind of in an awkward situation. Like, she doesn't. There's a whole thing. Like, if y'all are wondering why she not tell him when she found the baby, it's because she didn't want to say burden him. Like, she just left the dude, and she didn't want to be like, okay, we're having a kid now. You're trapped into this relationship. She didn't want that. She knew it wasn't right not telling him, but she didn't want to trap him. She wanted to give him the ability to live his life because a kid's a big responsibility, and she didn't want him to like have to like give up his hopes and dreams because. He talked about it. He talked about him being a music producer and doing this and doing that. And she knew that adding a kid on top of all of that would not like get him to do accomplish his dreams. So she didn't want to like add that burden on to him. But the reason why she's here right now is because her mom was calling in. Her mom married a really bad dude. Well, not really bad dude, but her mom married for the wrong reasons. And then she just she just couldn't take anymore. She just needed to go. So she found a job. Well, it's good, but she couldn't find a place to. Oh, she's sleeping. Uh, she couldn't find a place to live. And so she's like, I'll come. It's like the best time to see his father. He just turned to, he just turned into um a toddler. So now he'll know um whose father could be at least. And she wants to give him. She wants to give him that like ability she doesn't want to like keep him away from his dad of course not but um like i said it's like a really messed situation now um she's like very worried about what's this um hey do you want to do school no stay at school your sister would never do that um what's this congratulations um i heard sato and you are dating again um congratulations on landing a new boyfriend um she's happy about that but anyway she's feeling better which is good um okay she's just checking out making sure what's this oh he's gonna talk to her teach how to dance She's going to teach Crystal how to dance. Um, that's good. They were really good friends. You see, they still are good friends. Um, definitely. So we're going to discuss fashion with her. Um, give her a hug. Oh, she's not feeling good at all. Let's see. Let's share ideas with her. What's this? Okay, like these two are gonna talk. These two really need to go out and talk because, like I said, they're really close. And I feel like she would feel more better opening up to. She needs to change her outfit. She's just walking up in here with a little outfit. Half of a booty showing. Um, Where's change outfit? More. 
change into this one. Okay, okay, you know, he's sick. Why is everyone getting sick, my dude? Um, I guess he's gonna, no. Wait, who has the medicine? Oh, yeah, he has the medicine. Darn it, wrong person. But anyways, they're talking like, hey, is everything okay with you? Is everything good? He's like, yeah, I'm just, I'm just struggling, that's it. But I'll be fine. He's like, okay, you know, as long as you go chill as a grilled cheese, well, good. He's like, I know. Um, but yeah, she hasn't really had a time to like, like, she's gonna ask, like, so how are you and Sato going? Are you okay? So she's definitely gonna ask about her love life. Well, yeah, was everything good with you and Sato? Y'all back together, I heard um, from the grapevine that y'all were like, we're fine, we're fine. We're just talking things over. It's like, that's good. Um, what's this? Very angry. Oh, jeez. Why are you angry, my son? Okay, he's hungry and he's... It's like, I'll be right back. So anyways, what's this? Mom's like, congratulations on landing the new sweet job. Thanks, Mom. Like I said, she loves her mom, but she just doesn't like the situation her mom put her in. So the best thing she could do is, because her mom was happy, her mom is happy, so she doesn't want to ruin her mom's happiness. So she decided that um, the best thing that for her to do is to definitely just leave. That's the best thing for her to do, because she wants her mom to be happy. Give him some food. <laughs> um, she, okay, you know what he needs to do? He needs to practice his music, because now, this, better than ever, he needs to definitely get the show on the road. Um, resume tune when he's done eating. He has a lot to do today. And then she is going to work on getting her followers up, because that definitely needs to happen. Okay, she's on the computer. Wait, aren't you supposed to go to work? Jeez, go to work, go to work, go to work, go to work. Oh, God, you're late. You are so late. I'm like, Roxanne, you need to go to work. Go. Go to work, girl. Go. Um, and then you come upstairs. And then we are going to tell followers some jokes. And then we're going to update our status, of course. What else are we going to do? Share an image. Okay, she's going to go do that. She needs to get her social media up anyways. Are you eating? Please tell me you're eating. Oh, God, he put it on the floor. Okay, here. Take this bowl of that even pho. <laughs> you need that pho. And eat that. Eat this. Don't put it on the floor. Darn it. Okay, she's gonna come. And where's the food at? Go clean that up. <laughs> Throw that away. <sighs> oh my god. Again? Keon. What is... Why is he such a difficult child? My boy, you are cute, but you are difficult. <laughs> he is so difficult. Um, but okay, whatever. She's just gonna throw away the food. And then she's gonna go upstairs and she's going to put him to bed. Um, no. Uh, read it, read Keon to sleep. He needs it. <laughs> he needs to go to bed. And then she's gonna go and drink some tea. Okay, when you're done, you can have some tea too. What's this doing? Okay. But don't we have a one that we're closer with? Let me just make sure. Okay, he's feeling really sick. Um, resume that one. Okay, what's this? Um, the pun about the cat. Oh, it worked. Okay, she gained a hundred and something followers. Okay, no, that one's new. Let's do this one. Try this one. I'm sorry you're sick. Okay, this one's very close. Okay, perfecto. Finish this one. Get this one over with. Okay, you're almost done. <laughs> um, turn off. Turn off. Is this off? Okay, good. Oh, I thought she was going to read him to sleep. I guess not. Okay, she's going to tuck him in. That's sweet. Okay. Now go. What's this? Go grab some tea. Okay, what's this? Best image ever. Hey, she gained 20 followers. Nice. So Keon's asleep, finally. Thank God. <laughs> that took us a long time to do. Um, and then, yeah, these two are definitely going to come over here. And she's going to have a chat with her. Flatter. And we're going to, she's just going to be like, you are, you did so good with Keon. So good. He is, <laughs> he might be a monster a little bit, but you, you're a great mother. She's like, thank you. That means a lot. Um, so how old is he? He's, he's um, one and a half. He looks exactly like me. He's like, oh, I can see it. Oh, my dad's going to be crazy to go see me. Yeah. Um, I'm kind of afraid. Get, oh yeah. We need to show, oh God, we need to show, um, Devin, Devin's a grandfather. <gasps> Devin's a grandfather, guys. Jeez. Devin's gonna freak when he finds out. Um, what's this? Why is their relationship so low? Wasn't it higher before? Where is their relationship? Lexi, yeah, they're friends. They were good friends before, so they're definitely gonna get this up. Tell a funny story to her. You know, um, 
discuss. They have a lot to catch up on, you know, because she's been gone for so long. So she's definitely gonna just have a time just to sit down, have a conversation with her. Like they were really good friends. She misses her, of course. Like I know they need to talk. Like they need to talk. But right now it's just not the best time. It's kind of awkward. So they're just waiting for everyone to settle in, settle down, and then they're gonna talk it over with. Um, but yeah, Lance. That's the dude. I think so. No, that's what. This is a coworker. Who are you? Lance? Okay, we might have to introduce Lance to, um, to what's it called again? Definitely have to introduce Lance to, um, not Lacey, um, Lance to Jarnet Roxanne. There's so much options. Roxanne has Lance. Um, Roxanne also has that other dude, which I don't know his name. We have a few people to set up Roxanne with. Hmm. What's this? getting you a call um i heard you became good friends with them um, with myra pretty good friends no that means your relationship's down hold up who called us did they call you i don't even know okay who came home sorry guys so much okay our boy's home from work which is good um he had an embarrassing day embarrassed at work oh no i'm sorry dude um but he needs to okay oh okay that's why she also got paid too from um sick leaf right yeah she makes more money than him true and then what's this he wants to search up information about vampires now nah, don't do that uh he is going to come in take a vacation day no um let's see what's he gonna do he's gonna come over here and he's um he's gonna talk to his he's gonna talk to him um get to know because we need to know how he like he must be feeling some type of way about this so he's gonna go over and say like yeah like, dude are you really good how are you feeling about this situation it's like I don't know how I would feel if I was in a situation, so he's gonna be done that. He's gonna be able to finish his um this music by tomorrow, good hopefully. Um but yeah, his stuff's gonna come over and talk to him, just see how what's up with him, see how he's doing about the situation. No one's really asked him how he's doing about finding out that he's a father and he's he's, he's just there's a lot going on in his head because remember I said before, um, like I said before, he wants to be a music producer, but it's not easy being a music producer. It's hard nowadays to get into the music industry, and so now I know that he has like a son and a mouth to feed. It just adds more pressure onto what he's doing. So right now he has to get his button gear and he's doing all this, and it's just it's just added pressure. But he is happy inside knowing that he has a child. It's it's kind of like a relief. Like wow, I'm I'm a father. Like it just pops out of nowhere. I'm I'm a dad. I have a son, and his son doesn't know nothing about him. And so he's just I don't know how to explain it. He's just in his own little. Ooh, you see, he's ambitious. He's a very ambitious person. So he's definitely thriving about this. He's like I'm I'm gonna do it though. Like it's like I'm I'm gonna be okay, man. It's a shock for me. Never knew that I'd be a father so soon. But hey, it's it's gonna happen. He's like yo. So is everything good in career wise? Everything's fine. It's like um not really but i'm gonna bend with old friend <laughs> he's like i'll make it through though it's okay i just want to make sure that you're all good and he's gonna go over here and give him a hug definitely just be like yo man like yo, it's like yo man i'm here for you everything you know that it's like yeah, i know you're my boy <laughs> i love their friendship they've been friends since they were like little kids and they just grew up being friends oh yeah <laughs> I'm glad that he has Sato at least. That's good. He has that close of a friend at least. Someone that has his back 100%. But he definitely needs to go over and see his family soon. Um, I, I tell you, he's going to... I think I want him to do that. Not today. Maybe tomorrow we're going to go over and see his brother and his sister and his mom and dad. Well, his mom and his stepdad. He's going to go over and see them tomorrow and bring Crystal over. Definitely, um, but can't wait to come over here and clean up just for a little bit while Cairo, not Cairo, Ke <gasps> excuse me, Keon is asleep. What's this? He needs some amusement and he's hungry. What's this? He's going to throw a tantrum. No, don't throw a tantrum. Um, what's this? Why don't you do it? He's going to, what's this? Why don't you wake him up and then we're going to give him some tea. He's like, um, I'm going to wake up and take tea. Like, I'll take care of it. Um, what he's gonna do first? He hasn't done this. Yeah, like he hasn't done this. Like, yo, Lacey. Um, well, Lacey's playing video games right now, so we'll talk to her in a little bit. Uh, but let's say uh, he's gonna wake him up and feed him something because he's hungry. So wake him up, or maybe go use the washroom first. That might be safer. Bet. Go use the washroom. Oh God, this thing's broken. Um, Sato, can you repair that for me? I know you're tired, but can you pretty please repair that for me? And then my dude, can you? wake him up <laughs> she's so tired okay where are you gonna go she's gonna go to bed she yeah she's 
go to sleep. If you're both tired, go to sleep. Go to sleep, and then when you're done, um, you go to sleep. So she's gonna do some stuff for work tomorrow. She needs to more web, browse some fashion stuff for work tomorrow. And then my dude should probably be getting upstairs to wake up his son. He said he was like over like, well, she's doing her job. He's definitely going to help out for sure. So he's gonna wake Kian up. Oh, poor baby's all tired. And then we're going to more, he's not in a good mood, so let's give him some food. <laughs> Talking to him will not be the best idea. Okay, we're gonna give him food. Calm down. Stop trying to take Keon away from us. Let him be. There's so much we need to do. Like, we need to talk to Lacey. We need to tell Devin about this. Um, there's a reason why um, Lacey and Myra are good friends. Wink, wink to that. I'll talk about that in the next part, too, where you guys will get the full story on Lacey and what happened to her and why she's here and all that. Um, I'll let you guys know in the next part. <laughs> um... So stay tuned for that. Um, but we definitely need to take care of it. Like, look at him trying his best to be a good father. I love it. Okay. No, 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 no. I guess he's, I know he's being fussy. Look at his face. <laughs> um, give food. Damn, Keon, what's with that mug? Why, who are you so mad at? Man is pissed off at somebody. I wonder who. <laughs> Um, but like I said before, their relationship is coming from nothing. So he's trying to like, he has, he's going to have to build it up somehow. Um, you can't give up, Marcelo. You can't give up. I know it's weird for him, but I, I don't want him to give up on this. What's up? Why can't we do anything? Okay. So that, since that's not working, why don't you more open? Um, give, grab a serving, pick up serving. No, that's not what I want to do. More open, pick a thing, the foo out, and grab a serving for Keon. If you can't feed him in the high chair, then just give him the food. Then, <laughs> simple as that. Keon, we're giving you food. Calm down. Here, take it. Give it. There you go. Yes. Go sit somewhere. Okay. Hey. Oh, oh, she got a promotion. No, she's just coming from work. She got a vacation day though. That's good. Oh, so she's home. That's awesome. Does she know anyone by any chance? So she does. Okay. So these two are the plant sims today. But well, she doesn't know anyone that I want to set her up with. Darn it. Um. Is there, are they on the street by any chance? It's gonna be a long shot, but no. I don't think any of them are in this neighborhood. Tia's in the neighborhood. That's awesome. Tia should totally come see her um her um nephew. Nope. I don't think any of them. Wait, who's this? Tia. Oh, this is um, Val um not Valentina. Um, Violet. Violet's here too. Hmm. Let's see. Okay. Who did I want her to meet? You know him, right? So we have two guys. So we have this dude. Um, I still didn't fix his name. Can I switch it on here? Sims command, modify, kill, rename. So what should we name him? What should we name him? What should I, I didn't think of a name. His name is gonna be Brown. Brown, what Brown though? Um, I didn't think of his name. I didn't think of a name, my bad. Oh jeez, what's her J? I have oh, it's a J for now. I'll switch his name after, but we'll do him J Brown for now. J Brown. Uh, but um, his name's gonna be J with an I. <laughs> so his name's gonna be J Brown. Okay. Um, and we're going to invite him to current lot. Well, he's going to at least. Just for Roxanne, because I want Roxanne to meet some people, of course. Um, so he's a contender. And then there's also that other dude that I think she knows. No, you know him. Yes, he's from your work. Um, so there's Jay. And then we have, uh, where's the other guy? The other guy's name is Lance. I don't I don't know where he is. <laughs> he's, he's, he's from somebody's job. But anyways, I think from you. You know Lance? No. Oh, here is Duncan. Duncan's an also another contender. We have Duncan too. <laughs> um, who else? 
Lance, where's Lance at? I'm pretty sure so well, someone knows him. You got, we all saw him. I'll figure out him later. But um, you go over here and talk to Jay um, for the introduction because we brought him here just for you, girl. Go and work your magic. He's feeling tense. He's feeling hella tense. Look at that squirrel face. <laughs> um, we're going to give him a hello. What's up? He's like, oh, what's good? Um, debate game strategy. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Discuss the latest games. <laughs> That's gonna be a fun conversation. Ask about day, and then funny. Let's um, tell him a knock knock joke. He didn't like that at all, did he? Um, he didn't mind it. But what's this? From awkward conversation. What happened? Wait, why are you so upset? We fed you, y'all. We saw that, right? I gave him food. Oh my god, what's this? Is it a spoiled? Darn it. Oh, maybe that's why you need it spoiled. Spoiled. Okay, here. Grab some of that. <sighs> I'm not losing Keon and I just got him. <laughs> Come on, sit down and eat. Thank you. Oh, giving me a heart attack. <laughs> okay, that's good. He's eating. That's what matters. What's this? They're not taking him away, right? Okay, he's very angry though, so he's gotten that down, and then he's tired. He's extremely tired. He is just not a happy kid, is he? He's just not a happy camper. <laughs> um, so they're talking. They're, ha they're not having that good of a conversation. So just fun ideas, maybe. Like, she's like, I'm not looking for marriage, by the way. Apologize. Damn, this guy, they're just not hitting it off. Um, they're not hitting off. Ask about his day? I don't know. Try to chat. What's this? We're apologizing for doing what? I don't know, talking to you? <laughs> well, this doesn't look too good. Um, we're gonna ask him to leave because it's 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 not going well with him. He's he'd rather go use the computer. Wow, that's reassuring. Um Ask to leave. What are you gonna do, Keon? Keon, go play this. Um Ask for help. Marcelo, you go help your son out. Oh, that's sweet that he took care of the plates. Well, he didn't take care of the plates, but he put the plates up here at least. This place a little his house. Um, so you're gonna go help him out. Thank you very much. And then, what's this? Can you get your booties up and clean up this house for me? Because <laughs> this house is a mess. A huge, giant mess. So he's gone. That was a fail. But at least they somewhat know each other. But that was a huge fail. What's this? Oh, yeah, he didn't want to play. He just want to go to bed. Oh no, our dude's sick, but I'm pretty sure he has, yeah, he has some medicine. So, give it to him. Oh, that's sweet. I'll picture of this. He is looking so gross. <laughs> oh, I can just, okay, when you're done, um, drink this medicine. <laughs> Take medicine, please, because you look gross. What's this? He wants to. I'll start with his sister. That's sweet. We could definitely do that. Definitely. And then tuck him in again. Now, with, now that you have no scars on your back, that thing gross. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Man's a father. I'm proud of him. So sweet. Sweet like candy. Okay, that's good. Okay, so now what are we going to do? They need to say something to each other, so she's gonna come over here. Um, why don't you go over here and give her a pep talk. Just talk to her. What's this? She's gonna go do something right now, I don't even know what, but she needs to talk to him. And she is going to... The house is a mess. Oh, throw out the trash for me. Empty that out, <laughs> even though you're in your PJs. Empty that out. It's like, oh, um, I'm gonna just get out your guys' way. Y'all can talk as much as y'all need to. And then she's gonna go off to bed. What are you up to doing? So she's up here. Why don't you, just to get this out the way, what's this? Okay, bad conversation. Why don't you mm, hack someone's trust fund? Just because we need to program anyways. Get that over with. She's gonna do that. So they're talking. They're like, so are you gonna tell me what happened? She's like, I, I promise I'm going to tell you one day. Just. Not right now. Marcelo, I'm sorry for not telling you. I'm so sorry, but I had nowhere else to go. I needed somewhere to go, man. I'm, I'm sorry. He's like, listen, I'm not a llama. I'm not stupid. I won't. I, I understand. You can, you could have come here anytime. I promise I'll clean if I have to. I'll do it. It's like, listen, you're fine. Like, my house is your house. Don't worry about it. Um, just 
this. We need to talk about this, okay? Like I promised. And listen, you are gonna love me. He is exactly like you. Very bossy, very uptight, all over the place. He's exactly like you. He's like, I can tell just from being five minutes with him. Um, but we're gonna go and give him a hug just to express. Like, she's gonna give him a, like, thank you. For being such an understanding, it's like ah, thank you. Oh, it's good. It's good to see you. You know that. It's like it's good to see you too. I see. I love their relationship. I know this like put a def. I don't know, guys. I'm I'm confused. Y'all have to leave down below. What should Marcelo do? Should Marcelo be like pissed? Should she like he should he like move on with it? Should they like <laughs> like what should they do? Like what would you do for your Marcelo? What's this? Oh, did you do? It's not the time to like to like listen. I'm back. I bet she's like. Listen, dude, I know, not dude, but like Marcelo, I know that we left off on the right foot, but I'm not looking for a relationship right now. Um, you're free to date whoever you want to, and you can still be in um, Kyrie, Ky blah. You can date whoever you want to, but you're free to be, you can date whoever you want to, and, you're, and you'll always be able to talk to Ky Keon, but I'm not looking for anything right now. She fully just said, I'm, she's just not looking for no one. That maybe I don't know that she's just not playing games anymore. She's not about that. Like really, so I can't date you after everything. Like, I'm not. She's like fine, fine. I won't. I won't. Um, what's this? I don't want to chat. He wants to. Like, Listen, I'm sorry, but I'm just not looking for no baggage right now. If you understand what I'm trying to say, I just want to. She's like no, it's okay. I, I'm gonna go off the bed, but it's, it's nice seeing you. Okay. He's feeling hella embarrassed from doing that. He's like I um I'm off the bed. I'm um, have a good night. He's like. Yeah, I will. Night. <laughs> they still need to talk, but yeah, he definitely still he definitely still has feelings for this girl. Um, it's even in the red right now. <laughs> but she's just not about it. She's just not in the mood to like. It, she's she's just not in like stable enough. She feels to be even in a relationship with someone, even though he's the father of her child. I'm not saying that she doesn't love him. Of course, she has feelings in her heart for. Um, for uh what's called again marcella we just don't know how deep it is at this point right now it looks like she doesn't have any romantic but you never know what's gonna happen with these two but she's over here um doing her job of course what's up okay he's up oh he had a nightmare um can you oh poor thing um what's this lacy is gonna get up now what's this who's calling us hey no no <laughs> um so, so we're gonna go over here she is going to friendly soothe of course and then she's going to friendly um hug him and then she's going to funny tom a funny story just in trying to make him feel better he had a nightmare poor baby i'm sorry honey oh geez ref 37 minutes already oh i love this part i wanted to end i don't want to wait to film a next part R. see this is why i pre-record because i just love these lps so much that i just want to film it again <laughs> it's an addiction <laughs> i'm addicted to this challenge um i'm not challenged to this lp what's this we're gonna give him a hug um definitely um he needs oh jeez. what's this he wants to ask about as for drink we can do that later. But anyways, guys, I am going to end off this part here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes, guys, I'm going to end it off here. I hope you all enjoyed. I know there's so much more I want to talk about, so much stuff I want to do. But that's going to have to stay tuned for the next part. And I promise it won't be pre-recorded. But anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys on the flip side. As always, y'all know it. Deuces, y'all. Deuces.